The premise of this show is we're trying to find a, a girl for Prince Harry. Wow. <laughs> so that you know, take it very seriously. Holy, okay, okay. <laughs> so have you got anything you want to say to Prince Harry? I love you, you're the best, oh my God. <laughs> there will be times where we will want you to do the British accent. We'll try some warming up exercises that will help you get into the accent. So, can you repeat after me? Peter Piper picked a pack of pickled peppercorns. If Peter Piper picked a pack of pickled peppercorns, where's the pack of pickled peppercorns that Peter Piper picked? Go. Peter Piper peppercorn. Peter Piper peppercorn. Peter Piper peppercorn. Peter Piper picked a pack of corns and something else. Amazing. <laughs> we need to see how far you'd be willing to go on the show. Do you bruise easily? Um. No. I don't bruise that easily. Brilliant. So you, would you be able to withstand minor torture? What do you mean, torture? <laughs> um, yeah, yeah. Would you be willing to enter a medically induced coma for two months? <laughs> for the show? Yes, why not? Do you have any party tricks? I can vibrate my tongue. Wow. Oh, he'll love that. That will come in really handy for rimming. <laughs> Can you do any special tricks with your vagina? Not that I know of. Because the last girl said she could play the trumpet with hers. Do <laughs> you think maybe you could play like, the flute or the recorder? Yeah, we could maybe something like that. Another thing is you'll be having to go to press conferences. I'm going to just fire questions at you as British journalists and you have to rem remain composed and graceful like a princess. Princess, Princess Stephanie, what's Her Majesty like? She's actually very nice. Uh, Princess Stephanie, Princess Stephanie, is it true you take it out the arse, you Aussie whore? <laughs> Aussie bitch? Actually, no. Is it true that you're a tranny? No, it is okay, not. Why are you fucking lying, you Aussie bitch? I'm not lying. Go back to Ozland, you Aussie poor slag. <laughs> you're just jealous. Why, why would I be jealous of you? Because I'm with Harry. But you're not really, though, are you? On the show, we'll be sending you to lots of banquets and events. I mean, you'll be under scrutiny, full-time. Have you heard of a British uh, delicacy called Spotted Dick? <laughs> so if I could just see how you eat this. So just, uh, OK, just slowly eat the dick. Mmm, <laughs> put a bit more dick in your mouth. <laughs> Lady, like, maybe with your little finger, like... Is the dick delicious? It is delicious dick. Harry has a few uh, things he likes doing. He's into kind of furniture bondage, so he may want to, like, eat some sushi off of you. Just on me, just tell me to bend over and just eat off my back. And or... then you might have to, like, stay as a table for, I mean, not for very long, for about, like, 17 days or something like that. <laughs> That's fine. Would you allow Prince Harry to donkey punch you in the back of the head uh, during Congress? Sorry? Yeah, that'd be cool. 